this needs washed like this needs washed tonight so please ignore it but i have no time tomorrow to film a video turn my phone off apologies if this lighting's actually horrific i never filmed in my kitchen before my center my center okay let's just go with it let's just go with the flow so i haven't done an intro yet i'm actually so out of breath i have to check all that uni stuff from my garage into my kitchen basically 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 um hi guys <laughs> i'm not gonna start an intro yet um i wanted to do a uni haul of everything i bought to start uni so if you don't know me and this is your first time watching my channel i am my name is natasha and i'm 17 and i'm going to uni next week i'm going to glasgow university to study history and basically i just bought loads of stuff the past two weeks that i thought i would haul for you all because i think quite a few people watching probably are at uni or about to go to university um so it might be quite helpful for you but yeah i'm in my kitchen because I could not trek all of this stuff up to my room. There was so much stuff and I, like, I struggled getting it from my garage into here. So there was no way I was going upstairs. But yes, I want to quickly film this because I'm busy tomorrow and I want to get this up this weekend. Because I know a lot of people are actually going to uni this weekend. So yeah, for anyone going to like Dundee and Aberdeen, sorry, this might be a bit late. <laughs> but yeah, I'm going to start with, I've got a wee note of everything I talk about. I'm going to start with my bedroom stuff first. Some stuff hasn't arrived yet, so yeah, bear that in mind. Bedroom. First of all, I have this mer oh, lovely look. look at my setup. My camera is on a sports bag and a jumper. Love it. <laughs> so this is a mirror from IKEA. Oh yeah, so I'll do my IKEA stuff first. So this is from IKEA. It's called Tisness. And it's basically just a free a stand-in mirror. It looks like that. And it's just like white. It's really sleek. Like I saw it in the store and it just looked really sleek and like chic. I liked it. And this was, I think, £20. I think it was £20. So, or maybe just under that. So yeah, it was more expensive than their usual, like, circle mirrors that they have. But I just really liked it and I thought, it's huge as well. It'll be so good for doing my makeup and things. So yeah, I got that for my bedroom. Oh, this might be quite hard to show, but this is a lamp. It doesn't look like a lamp, I know, but it's basically like a frosted pink colour. They have it in blue and white as well. And it's just like a free standing cube type of thing. But yeah, it's called, I will write all the names down below, but I don't know what this is called. Oh, here we go, it's on the top. Grono, yeah. Yeah, so it looks like, that's what it looks like. It's just like a free standing square type thing. But yeah, this is called Grono and it's just like a frosted pink lamp for my bedside table. I can't really show you this properly, but this is called the Cullen and it's a two drawer um, bedside table and it's just plain white and um, I think it's a gloss, I don't think it's, it's either gloss or matte, I can't remember which one. Um, but yeah, if you've been to Ikea, you've probably seen these before. It's just a plain, simple two door chest, um, not chest drawers, dream, la, 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 bedside table because I don't think we're going to get one of these and it's also just extra storage as well because it's got huge... Um, big drawers so it should be really handy and this is only £20 which I thought was a really good bargain actually and it just looks really nice it's just plain white and it'll just go with everything this is kind of for the bedroom because I'll be using it in my bedroom this is a drying rack yeah drying rack um, it's a small one it's not a huge one it's just a mini one which I thought would come in handy for just drying my wet clothes so yeah, I didn't think I need a big one because I mean, there's not going to be that many clothes, it's just me, isn't it? So yeah, I got that from my room. Okay, next I have a photo frame, um, just from Ikea. I think it's about £5, I think. Um, yeah, it was slightly more expensive than some of them because it has like a bigger outer type of thing, if you get what I mean. <laughs> but yeah, this is just called the Nop, Nopang. And it's a 30 by 40 because basically I've ordered about five or six prints from Decenio, um, a really, really cool website for posters and stuff. I like highly recommend it. And it's not too expensive either. And it's quite easy to find like a discount code on people on like Instagram and stuff. So yeah, I've ordered loads of prints from them. But basically I'm going to frame one of them and like hold it against, not hold it, but like, just like place it maybe on my 
my desk, my desk. So like behind maybe my makeup stuff, I'll just have this like placed. You know what I mean? Because I can't have it on the wall because like, you get into trouble. So I'll just be on my desk. And then for the rest of the posters, I'm just gonna um, put them on a pin board and i am got some things to put them on, which I'll show you later. Um, I'm just gonna like place them on a pin board or the walls, but with command strips, because that works for like putting things on the walls without putting holes in the walls. So yeah, got this one. And, oh, an Ikea um, picture frames are cheaper than ones in Decennial. So I just brought mine from there instead of that website. Okay, this is something I actually already have. And I don't know what I'll do with this. I don't know if I'll have it up. I'm not entirely sure. But this is from literally when I was like a baby. I think I had this on my wall when I was so young. And it's just like a baby pink checked thing for like holding pictures and I know my theme for my room is going to be like baby pink and silver type of thing so my mum found it and I thought it might come in handy so I'm going to bring that one okay then I got from Amazon this, this next off's Amazon I'm sorry I'm going to mix it up because it's all in different places but from Amazon I bought the lead clip string lights from Ustelar. These were £10 I think. Um, but basically my idea is these ones are pegs with the fairy lights in the peg. Cool eh? So basically I had this idea I want to have my fairy lights so my bed will be, bed will be here and that wall with my bed. I'm going to have my fairy lights along it and then clip photos into the things but since they have the pegs it's just so much easier than because I was thinking I had to do like put the pegs on the fairy lace but no there's actually places that do this so I bought them for my room to hold um, pictures which I think will look so cute and then to hang the fairy lights I these things I got these these are the command what is command decorating clips so you just stick these on the wall and there's a wee hook that you put the fairy lights over to hang them. But these are great because they don't ruin the wall, um, apparently. So yeah, gonna, these are going to come in very handy. And then along with that, I've got the command strips, but actually in a form of a strip. So I'll use these for hanging posters and any other spare pictures that I want to put up on my board or anything. And then, lastly from Amazon, I got this acrylic three drawer organizer from Osco Storage. And it's basically just a simple acrylic um, makeup organizer. So yeah, this, that's the idea. Um, acrylic um, storage is so expensive. Like you wouldn't think it, cause it's just acrylic. But yeah, I tried to research a lot of different um, brands of these things on Amazon because um, there's there's so many different types of ones but this was the cheapest and most effective looking one I kind of found so I'll basically use this for lipsticks um, I can use it for all my face products and then my idea is to just like put my foundation and primer and stuff on top of it um, so yeah it's just a really effective way of like having your makeup look nice but also just organized okay Onto my bed stuff, so I'm not going to show you but my actual duvet, I think it's just like an old one we have that I'm taking with me, so yeah, um, I won't show you that, it's just a plain white duvet, but oh I love this so much, yeah. okay, so this, this is for Matalan, this stuff, okay, so this is my rug, so soft, <laughs> okay, it's like a grey rug, with silver specks if you can see so there's like silver specks running through it and it's just a, it's, a, it's a small rug but it basically it's just to go on my floor because i feel like the floor won't be very nice so it just might make it feel more homely and stuff if i have like a rug going over it and um, so yeah this was from my plan i think this is 20 pound okay i'll put that there Oh. oh, this stuff is so fun. It makes me so excited. Okay. Then, these are the pillows I got from Matalan. Yeah, Matalan. So I've got a silver fluffy one. Because my theme's silver and pink. This was 
10 pounds for this one. And then I have this mahoosive one. God, <laughs> it's like a pink sat satin, is it satin? Yeah, it's like satin. So yeah, these go really nicely together. So this was for my plan as well. It's just to go on my bed, this was 12 pound. Oh God, that's a huge. Oh, look how soft this looks. This is my, this is a super soft full fur throw and it's in a, a blush pink, I'll say. Yeah, it's like a blush pink. And it's just gonna go at the bottom of my bed, 25 pound. And yeah, just, if people think that like I'm spending like money, I, I felt that I wanted to spend a bit more money for like my bedroom stuff. So, cause I want it to make it feel homely. I want it to put my own spin on it. Cause I think I'll feel way more comfortable like being in a new place for the first time. If I have some like home comfort type of thing. Like I'm bringing a few things from my room right now, which I think will make me feel more at home and just, yeah made me feel good. So yes, this is what I got from Matalan. That, that, and that. Totally underestimated how much, like how much stuff you need for uni and how expensive it's gonna be. Like, um, yeah, it's, it's quite crazy. So, um, and there's cheap, there's cheap ways of doing it. Like, obviously Ikea's great for lots of things, but it still adds up. It, um, yeah, I would just be aware um, that you, you are gonna spend quite a bit of money starting uni but like as me and my mum were saying I'm going to try so hard to like obviously keep all this stuff for like second third fourth year blah 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 this is from Asda and it's just a mattress protector to go over my mattress because I don't know how nice the mattress is going to be <laughs> so yeah it just makes it feel a bit more soft and comfortable I don't know how much this was but I can try and find it and then this is a storage thing for my um wardrobe but I'm not sure exactly what storage I'm going to get for my clothes but yeah it's from Ikea and it's one of those you know pop out type of things that you can put shoes and stuff in and this was only about I think it was only three quid I think and it's called scub so yeah for my to make myself have more room then I have a um umbrella which will come in very handy as I think Glasgow rains a hell of a lot in, La in Glasgow so yeah, this is only a couple of pounds as well Ikea got two more of these I've got these in my room already but two of these for my makeup brushes both from Ikea so yeah simple but fab <laughs> oh <laughs> these are old flip-flops because I think my mum thinks I I think I do need these for like bathroom and stuff because um I'm having a shared bathroom so I think they'll be handy <laughs> Then I have, uh, I think this is hand towel. Yeah, I think this is the, just a baby pink hand towel from Ikea. I think it was only a couple of pounds as well. Um, a light bulb for my lamp and a bin, because we all need a bin. This is Ikea as well, only a couple of pounds. Just simple white bin. <sighs> three packs of, I'm not gonna show you the third one, but three packs of hangers for my wardrobe, but, um, all Ikea. Um, I have two packs of the wood one and one black pair. Then, I'm not going to show you, but I have um, towels, a few towels from, that my grandma has kind of given me. And also she gave me like tea towels, all that type of stuff that I didn't need. And like sheets and duvet covers that I all had, so I didn't need to buy any of them. I've just gone for plain white for my like duvet covers and stuff and pillows. Um, just so that it goes with anything if I change like pillows up or whatever. Oh yeah, I got one of these. Um, Ikea, one of the big Ikea big bags. It's just a baby pink colour. And I thought this would come in really handy for if it, like to put the back of my bed um, and put like dirty washing in um, so that if I'm doing a wash, I can just take the bag at the end of the week and do my washing. So yeah, that was very handy. They've got loads of these like at the counter, at the checkout, and um, just at the end to pick one of them up. And I can use it for shopping as well and stuff. Oh, these are cute, aren't they? Okay, so mum recommended I get some cactuses. Cacti. Cacti. Because um, my sister Stephanie um, has quite a few of these in her room and she loves them. And they don't need much care at all. So that's good because I feel like I'll forget to do it. But yeah. Oh, how cute. So I just got three 
um, little cactuses. I think this one's blooming, maybe that's why they've got the thing around it. Okay, this is a uh, some sort. I can't remember when I got this. It's just a uh, plain. What do you call these? Um, kind of quite glass pot things. But yeah, I thought this would be nice um, in my room maybe to hold things. <laughs> I'm not really sure what, I just saw an Ikea and I liked it. So yeah, I might put like um, sweets, chocolate, like any food that I want to keep in my room and not in like the kitchen stuff. So yeah, I'll, I'll use it for something. This is called Nara and it's from Ikea again and I thought this would come in handy as because I'm not, I've not gotten an ensuite. I'll have a, um, a sink. So in my room, and this was, I was thinking, I'll just put this under my sink, um, with like any, um, toiletries, um, and like skincare type of things. I'll keep like underneath it. Um, so yeah, I thought it was really cute as well. It looks really nice. Uh, it was really cheap as well. So yeah, I liked it. So I got that for like bathroom type of things. And then we have an old one of these adapt what are these called? Cable things. It's just an old one, I didn't need to buy one, yay. <laughs> so yeah, one of them. Then I have toothpaste, um, lots and um, some conditioner, shampoo, and uh micellar water. I've not done like a food shop for like starting or like a um that type of shop, like more toiletries. I'll do that um, probably next week. Um, but yeah, that'll just be basics. Tell you my kitchen stuff. All my kitchen stuff is from um, Ikea, I think. Um, and then I got a few things from Meryl. If you watch my vlog, um, oh, when, 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 when's that vlog going up? I think the vlog went up before this video, but if not, my, um, my um, grandma's friend got me a, um, bag of like things for uni and in that was like stationary things so I don't need to buy any of that uh, and she got me a few kitcheny things which is really good and really helpful but yes for my for the kitchen I have a wee storage thing if I want to um take like any food out or have leftovers and um, I've got three of these two small and one big one uh, a pint jug for measuring a bowl for mixing, a two um, set um, pan, a small one and a big one. What's this? Another dish thing for cooking. And then this is an old one that we have that I'll take, which is a big, huge dish pan thing. Don't know what I'll do with that, but we'll learn. <laughs> then we have another old dish that mum's let me take for like I don't really know what I'm gonna do with this but yeah another tray and then another tray for food <laughs> god I've got so much trays um, two glasses from home that I'm taking Ikea plate in pink and two old plates that I'm taking, an oven mitt from Ikea, a mug, I've got a pink mug, I've got one upstairs that I'm taking, um, some bowls, a white one, a yellow one, a pink one, a sieve, a grater. Then, then I got a cutlery pack from Ikea but I'm not taking it all because I don't need that much. I think I've got two or three Two sets of cutlery did I have? Two or three sets of cutlery I'm gonna take because I feel like you're gonna lose them along the way at some point. So yeah, just a plain set of cutlery, um, a couple um, old sharper knives, two more basic mugs that I've got, they're old. I've got quite a few old kitchen things that um, either my grandparents or my mum have that they're not using that I can take. Um, then a pair of these are Ikea tongs thingies. Spatula, ladle, whisk, scissors, can opener, spoon. Oh, and as well, I also have a um, a board to like cut everything on the like car. Where is it? Uh, like a board. 
This is an old one, so saws it's dirty. <laughs> but yeah, one of those boards too. So yeah, I think, I think that's everything that I've got as of now, which is a lot. I feel like I don't need to get any more right now. I'm just waiting on my um, prints and my photos to come um, from Decenio, and I've also got lots of um, of my own photos being printed off Snapfish, which is a really easy website to use and um, really cheap as well. So I recommend that. Um, they're all, they're all arriving next week. Um, so yeah, apart from the food stuff that I'll get, um, I think that's basically it. Yeah, I think I'm basically, I'm set. Which is good, because I only have a week. And I don't want to be too stressed. And I think from now on, I think I'm starting to do like pack, start getting packed and like getting all my clothes ready. So yeah, it's going to be quite a task moving in, getting all this in. But we'll, we'll do it and I'll have, um, I'll do, do, do a moving vlog. Um, so yeah, um, be excited for that. <laughs> but yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video and I hope um, you might find it helpful in any way if you're going to uni. So yeah, thanks for watching and um, don't forget to hit the thumbs up button, comment down below and subscribe to my channel. Um, and yeah, I'll see you in my next video. Bye bye. Hey. <laughs>